Hello everyone and welcome back, long time no see you. This might be my first video when I talk with you guys. So anyway, you might have clicked on this video because you were curious about who the fuck loves Kata, why would you love Kata? The answer might be pretty simple, it's just my first expansion. And I like dragons and werewolves. But how do I start uh, to play WoW? The story is more complicated. For the context, I am Romanian, yes, the coolest country in the Balkans. I know. So, back then, when I was a kid, my parents did not have a good financial situation, so my mother went to work in Italy. My father worked as a locomotive driver, so when my father had no one to leave me with, he would just take me with him to work. So, basically, I went to a few towns and saw the beautiful landscapes of Romania. And I remember a few times when we went to a more evolved town than ours and I think that uh, because uh, it had a McDonald and I ate a few burgers and I thought it tasted delicious from Mac. Today I hate Mac by the way. But anyway, back to the story. So one time when my father took me with him, we went to a town where one of his co-workers invited us to his home for lunch. We went there and uh, his son, a bit older than me, was playing on the computer. And of course his father told me to join. But uh, since I was younger than his son and also a bit anxious, I just told him that I just wanted to watch how is he playing. And guess what he was playing? Yes, he was playing World of Warcraft. But of course, since we were Balkans kids, <laughs> we couldn't afford the WoW subscription. So he was playing on a private server, which I don't remember the name of. But that's not important. So I really liked the game because I saw him fighting with gargoyles which for, for me were just some cool flying monsters at the time. And uh, I literally remember he was in Zuldrak at the Argent stand, if you ever leveled up in Northrend, well, probably he was uh, doing some quests. So after that day me and my father went back to the locomotive and uh, went home. Since I really liked that game, I told my father that I wanted to play it. So he called his co-worker and asked him how can I play the game. His co-worker told his son about it and he sent me the game via mailbox installed on a DVD. When I got the DVD, I put it on the computer and installed it and I realized that I couldn't play it. The thing was that I was too young to understand English, uh, <laughs> that was around maybe 29 or 2010. So I couldn't play it and I went back to play my main MMORPG at that time, Metin 2, which was a popular game in Balkans and I think it might be even today. Anyway, so after a few months I met another kid who was the son of another co-worker of my father. This time was different, because we lived in the same town and his grandma was living in the same building with me. Sometime I was invited to his home to play video games together. After I went to his home, I saw him playing exactly the same game and I asked him how is he able to play. She, since he was older than me, he understood English better than me. He explained to me that I needed an account to play and configure some files to be able to play. He was playing on a private server for free, then he helped me to make an account and let me play on his computer. After that, we met another day at my home and he helped me to install WoW and to configure the server. I remember that we were playing on the Wrath of the Lich King server at that time. I think it was around 2010-2011. After a few weeks of playing and leveling my character up to level 75 or something, he showed me the trailer of a new expansion, which was Cataclysm. The trailer made me really excited seeing that wing a giant dragon destroying the world. I wanted to play it so hard since I really like dragons. After that I saw more videos and one of where Blizzard was showing that you will be able to play as a wargun. And I was really happy about it because I was really obsessed with the werewolves. I had that obsession because my favorite movie was uh, Van Helsing 24 and I saw it a lot of times. I just liked the idea of being a werewolf and killing vampires or monsters. Every year on my birthday I invited my friends to my house and we were playing video games on my computer. When lunchtime was coming my parents were ordering pizza for us and we were watching the movie. That was like a ritual every year. That movie was literally on repeat all day even if we were watching it or not. So yeah, sorry I strayed from the main story, so the expansion wasn't released yet at that time and we were just playing on uh, our server. 
after uh, the expansion was released we couldn't play it since we didn't have money for subscription so we just waited until someone would release a private server until then i was watching videos on youtube and my favorite series was a wow cataclysm guide work and starting zone from total biscuit which passed away in 2018 unfortunately i was sad when i found out Sorry for the sad moment guys, I wanted to mention it because it was a happy part of my childhood memory. After a few months of the official release, someone released a Cataclysm private server and me and my friend were finally able to play it. I was so bad at playing the game but I like it so much and I was so excited that I could finally play as a worker. I liked it so much and I was so excited that I could finally play as a worker. I enjoyed the starting zone so much that I would literally create more worgans just to play it again. I also liked the war between worgans and undeads, I also created a few undead characters to see their part of the story, which was uh, really good, not gonna lie. So yeah, that's the story of why I love Cataclysm. Also since there is already Cataclysm Classic released, I might try it and record some videos for YouTube. Maybe you will get recommendations if I will do it. I'm not sure yet, cause yeah, life. At present I'm technically an adult and I have faculty courses and a job and not so much time for gaming as I would like. But anyway, I hope you like this video and you can tell me in the comments if you want more videos like this or if you want me to talk about something else. Thanks for watching and see you soon. Goodbye.